Welcome to Abu Dhabi Saadiyat Island. It is located 10 kilometers from the center of Abu Dhabi, the capital of the United Arab Emirates. Its area is 27 square kilometers and it is designed to accommodate 145,000 people. For example, the Palm Jumeirah Islands in Dubai are less than 6 square kilometers with a population of 80,000 people in 2022. Saadiyat is a natural island, famous all over the world for its beaches, turquoise waters and golf courses. It is home to turtles, dolphins and Arabian gazelles. The Saadiyat Cultural District occupies 10% of the western part of the island. The Louvre Abu Dhabi opened here in 2017 and the Guggenheim Museum will open in 2025. In addition, the Sheikh Zayed National Museum, designed by Forstein Partners, and the Abu Dhabi Performing Arts Center, designed by Zaha Hadid, are under construction. Saadiyat Island is also home to Berkeley University and New York University, and for six years Abu Dhabi has been ranked the safest place in the world. So, do you want to live on Saadiyat Island in Abu Dhabi? I'm Sander and I recommend you the best places to live and invest in real estate in the United Arab Emirates. Did you know that the United Arab Emirates has seven Emirates in total, but Abu Dhabi is the government's home and residence of the president? And Abu Dhabi contributes to third of the UAE's economy. The population of Abu Dhabi is around 1.5 million compared to 3.5 million people in Dubai. But Abu Dhabi is considered to be the wealthiest city in the world. The income per capita or GDP is 130,000 US dollars, while in Dubai it is only 44,000. Abu Dhabi Airport, the second biggest in the country after Dubai, received 15.9 million passengers in 2022 compared to 66 million in Dubai. The launch of Etihad Rail will connect Fujairah, Dubai and Abu Dhabi. And with a high-speed train, you can travel from Abu Dhabi to Dubai in 50 minutes. So, how much does real estate on Saadiyat Island cost compared to Dubai? Meet Mamsha. Mamsha and Saadiyat is Aldar's luxury beachfront development on Saadiyat Island. It was built in 2019. There are 461 apartments ranging from 120 to almost 2,000 square meters, from one-bedroom units to five-bedroom penthouses. And most importantly, you can enjoy the white sand beach in front of the house and the breathtaking panoramic sea views. We can compare Mamsha al Sadia to Blue Waters Island and Imar Beachfront in Dubai regarding location, scale and quality. Renting a one-bedroom apartment will cost about 170 to 190,000 dirhams a year or about 46 to 52,000 US dollars. Two-bedroom apartment would cost from 5,700,000 to 6,500,000 dirhams or about 1,550,000 to 1,800,000 US dollars. What about Blue Waters Island in Dubai? Renting a one-bedroom apartment will cost between 300 to 350,000 dirhams a year or about 81 to 95,000 US dollars. A two-bedroom apartment would cost from 8 million to 10 million dirhams or about 2,170,000 to 2,725,000 US dollars. And finally, a Mar beachfront in Dubai. Renting a one-bedroom apartment would cost between 170 to 200,000 dirhams a year or about 46 to 55,000 US dollars. A two-bedroom apartment would cost from 5 million to 5 million 500,000 dirhams or about 1 million 360 to 1 million 500,000 US dollars. So, where would you prefer to live and invest in the UAE? Sadiat Island, Blue Waters Island or Emar Beachfront? Please comment. Let me answer the frequently asked questions about living on Saadiyat Island. Can a foreigner buy and own property in Abu Dhabi? Yes, in 2019, the Abu Dhabi government introduced a law specifying the areas where foreigners can own property. While previously only long-term leases for 99 years were allowed, it is now possible to own property unconditionally. And Saadiyat Island is one of the areas where you are entitled to purchase and own real estate in Abu Dhabi. Can I get a residence visa in Abu Dhabi? Yes, investing 2 million dirhams or more in real estate gives the whole family a 10-year golden visa. 
Are there any schools for children on Sardiad Island? Yes, and you can choose from a British school, a French Lyceum, an American school or a Montessori kindergarten. Probably the most affordable option is at the French Lyceum. It will cost from 8,700 to 14,500 US dollars per year per child. The British school is more expensive, and education will cost between 18 and 26,000 US dollars per year per child. How much would private health insurance cost? On average, private health insurance costs 10,000 dirhams a year, about 2,700 US dollars. If you are young, around 30 years old and healthy, the insurance will cost 5,500 dirhams a year, about 1,500 dollars. And for a family of four with enhanced coverage, you must pay 33,500 dirhams a year, or about 10,000 US dollars. Which are the best banks to use in Abu Dhabi? I can recommend three of the biggest banks in the country. The largest bank in the United Arab Emirates is First Abu Dhabi Bank, which was originally founded in Abu Dhabi. Emirates and BD Bank is one of the largest banking groups in the Middle East and the second largest bank in the UAE. Abu Dhabi Commercial Bank is one of the largest banks in the UAE with a market share of around 10-11% in deposits and loans. So, do you want to live on Sadiat Island in Abu Dhabi or do you have any further questions, please comment. And if you need help finding a property and moving to Sadiat, feel free to message me on WhatsApp or Telegram, all my contacts are in the description. And like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel so you won't miss anything exciting in the future. That's it for today and I look forward to welcoming you to Abu Dhabi soon.